Hello family, greetings in Jesus' name. I received a word from the Lord of spending time with me in Christmas. My mentor had a wonderful visitation from the Lord. And I began to dream too. That became a trap for me, for attachments to have or receive something apart from Lord's will will cause us trouble. As I was expecting, a familiar spirit slipped in and I fell for it. I was hurt and wounded and I realized good Lord was humbling me. Still Lord forgave and spoke to me. I came before the Lord in the morning. Lord began to speak. Dear one, forgive me for spoiling your expectations. That's not what I intended. My dear one, trust me in days to come, more is coming. Trust me, my heart feels for you. It's not my desire to put you through this fire. But I am purifying you. Don't be afraid. The real reason I'm doing this, my daughter, you need to be pruned more. Trust me, after this, you are ready to serve me. My dove, thank you. Humble yourself, dear. It's pain, I know, but your acceptance of it opens the way for me to work in you. When you succeed in one thing, you can easily overcome other things too. Trust me, I'm there protecting you. I will never leave you. I trust you, Lord. Lord continued. My dear, now listen to my heart. Be mine. Much is to come. I am preparing you for what is to come. As you already know, I give precious crosses to those who are willing. You are willing. It's dear to me. Dear, I love you, bowled over by your submission, as you, learning to continue to apply every day and humble yourself. I am there, I am for you. Trust me, I am there. That was the end of the Lord Jesus' message. Well, and sisters, let's not be disappointed when things are not our way. Trust the Lord. Things get more better with the Lord rather than our desires and expectations. Amen.